All right, now in this example, we're told that the original price on a television is $850. And we're told that it's on sale at 35% off. And they ask us, what is the amount of the discount? In other words, how much is going to be taken off of the TV here? Well, recall that to get a percentage of a number, all you do is take the given sales rate, or the percentage, or the sales tax, whatever it is, and multiply it by the original price. But you have to do this with this as a decimal number. So first, we're going to convert the sale percentage from a percent to a decimal. Now, recall that when you go from a decimal number to a percent, you move two hops to the right. But we're going backwards. We're going from a percent to a decimal. So we need to move two hops to the left. Now, where is the decimal number if they don't write it? Or the decimal point, I mean? Well, they put it right here at the end. So if I move two hops to the left, 35%, that's going to be point, point. That's going to be 0.35. And you can put the zero there or not. It doesn't make a difference. And so to get the actual amount saved, we're going to do the original price of $850 times the sales percentage of 0.35. I'm going to check this in the calculator. So 850 bucks, 35% of that, or in other words, times 0.35. That's going to give me $297. And the calculator says 0.5, but remember, we're talking about money here. So 0 0.50, $297.50. So if the original price is 850 bucks and it's on sale for 35%, the amount you're saving, not the amount you're paying, but the amount you're saving is $297.50. And that's this example.